What's up guys, it's me, your badass host, Draven, and welcome to another episode of our Pokemon Crystal Walkthrough, the 2022-2023 edition? I don't know, maybe? Let's find out. So, in our last episode, we went to Mount Mortar on a little side quest to grab a few items. We managed to find the Dragon Scale and get ourselves a Tyrogue while we were at it. And, uh, well, now that we got the Dragon Scale, we are able to do this. Now, I know I could have done this a while back when by sending the Dragon Scale from Pokemon Gold. But I was like, you know what, let's make it an adventure. Let's make it something that, you know, these guys would want to watch. Uh, well, watch find or, you know, watch me find it and all that stuff. We went to Mount Mortar, found the Dragon Scale. It was all because, well, we completed all eight badges and all that stuff. And if you guys may remember, a few episodes ago, I traded for Torpedo, a copy of Torpedo, that would actually learn some of the brand new moves here in Pokemon Crystal. And now that we have equipped Torpedo with the Dragon Scale, we are able to do this. Let's go ahead and start trading to Pokemon Gold and back. Let's go ahead and get Torpedo. Yes, right here. And let's go right ahead and pick a Pokemon that we don't have in our Pokedex. Now, I would love to put Ho-Oh on, on the... Like, I would like to trade Ho-Oh to Pokemon Crystal, but I kind of need to check out the Pokemon entry while we catch it in Crystal. So, yeah, let's go straight to Ombreon right here. You guys may remember, Ombreon's a pretty good Pokemon. So let's go ahead and fill up the Pokedex right here. Switch them out. And just like that, guys... Bam! We are trading, and well, we all know, we all love the trade episodes right here. I've seen the first trade episode, and well, look at this! Here we have Torpedo evolving, and this is all thanks to the Dragon Scale, and look at this! Just like that, we finally got ourselves a Kingdra, completing our Johto-based Pokemon team. And, uh, well, the trade is complete, look at that. Let's go ahead and save and continue and trade these Pokemon back. So let's go right ahead and do that. So here we go. Let's go right ahead and uh, get Ombreon over there. And what's another one right here? Let's go ahead and get Torpedo back to the team. Alrighty. Let's go ahead and trade. Now, again, I did... Tr like, the reason why I didn't uh, trade most of my Pokemon to from Yellow to... You know, Pokemon Crystal is because if you trade so many times onto this all at the same time, yes, there will be a little bit of a glitch. So, yeah, this is why we're doing it one by one and all that stuff. Anywho, let's go right ahead and check out the Pokedex. Um, actually, that's a that's a PC box. Let's go straight to the Pokedex right here. And we're going to go all the way back down right here. And as you can see, we have 38 of our own, but we have caught 61 Pokemon right here. And, well, I think I've passed. I think I may have passed it. Okay, so let's see. Actually, first is first. Take a look at this, guys. We got Entei. And if you want to take a look at the area, it's nowhere to be found. And you can't really check the Kanto region because we haven't really crossed that. And, well, before anything fucks up, let's go right ahead. And... Ah, there you go. Kingdra, number 230. So here it is, guys. Kingdra, the water and dragon type Pokemon. 511. It is said to... It is said that it usually hides in underwater caves. It can create whirlpools by yawning. This is a very, very... Very awesome looking Pokemon right here, guys. Look at this. It actually looks like a dragon. It really does. So, we're going to go straight into Pokemon Crystal. I want to show you a little thing right there. and uh, Or I want to show you the entry in that one. And then we'll pretty much uh, finish our episode right there. So, I'll be right back with you guys. Alrighty, guys. So, here we are back in Pokemon Crystal. And let's go right ahead and take a look at our newest Pokemon, Torpedo. Or, you know, Kingdra. So here it is guys, Kingdra, female, and it is now a water and dragon type Pokemon. This is like the first time ever that we actually have some kind of like dragon type Pokemon on our team. And well, we've had dragon types here before, but in, in uh, Pokemon Crystal, it's been, you know, a hot minute since I've actually had an actual dragon type Pokemon on my team. 
So, here it is. Still has the same moves and everything, but as you guys can see, it's... It's stats are pretty even now. Like... This Pokemon has the chance to become my strongest Pokemon. This is one of the Pokemon that I've always wanted on the team. Uh, ever since I will... As a kid, I've always wanted a Kingdra, but always wondered how I was going to do that. And then, when, you know, I figured out what trade evolution was. Yeah, that right there was a, a huge bummer and all that crud. So, let's go right ahead and take a look at the Pokedex entry from a Pokemon Crystal. It might be different, might be the same, who knows. Uh, first is first, we got an Ombreon. So as you guys can see, Ombreon is now in our Pokedex. On the night of the full moon, or when it gets excited, the ring patterns on its body glow yellow. Okay. And here we have... Actually, let's go ahead and take a look at our all three entries of the Horsey line right here. As you can see, Horsey, the Dragon-type Pokemon, or the Dragon Pokemon, when they are in a safe location, they can be seen playfully tangling their tails together. Okay. The next one, let's see, Seedra. The male raises the young. If it if it is approached, it uses a toxic spikes to fend off its intr the intruder. Okay, and here we have Kingdra, the pure dragon type Pokemon. All right, 335 pounds of pure muscle right here. It stores energy by sleeping at, uh, at underwater depths at which no other life forms can survive. Maybe, you know. Maybe, uh, what was it called? Uh, Lugia can. Yeah, it sounds it sounds pretty legit right there. So, I am really excited, guys. Very, very excited. Now, I was trying to save this episode for, you know, episode 51 and all that crud, but I kind of decided that, you know what, let's go right ahead and get this Pokemon, get it out of the way, start getting our team ready because we got a Pokemon League to win. But... We still got a few side quests to do before we even get to the Pokemon League. I still need to train some of my Pokemon and all that stuff. But, yes, in the next episode, we are going to be going into the All Week family. If you guys don't know what that is, you'll see in the next episode because it will be beneficial for your adventure right here. So, thank you guys again for watching. Hope you enjoyed this trade episode. If you guys want to make a small donation to this channel, keep it running and all that stuff, hit the heart button right there. I don't even think the link in the description works anymore. I'll be back for another episode of Pokemon Crystal. See you guys.